I'm Matt Molina. Uh, I do guitar and vocals for Mean Beans and Dream Beans. I'm Matt Taylor, and I do drums for Mean Beans and Dream Beans. And um, I guess the two of us are Mean Beans. Dream Beans would be uh, the two of us with uh, a wide collaboration of other local musicians. Matt Taylor and myself started writing music back when we were like 15. So that was like, what, nine years ago, I think, we've been playing music together now? My first day of school here, I had just moved to Tucson. Uh, Matt Molina was in my first period class, and I believe I it was English. I kind of walked up to him. We were doing group activities, and I walked up to him and threatened to beat him up if I uh, couldn't be in his group. So we became friends like that. And later that day, he was trying to find my house and uh, stumbled across a meth head. <laughs> stumbled across a, a meth house, and it wasn't my house, but he eventually found my house, and we've been pretty much writing music together ever since. I would say one half of our style is very folk, uh, some of it very angry, drunk, alcohol-influenced music, and then others is very marijuana-influenced music, very calm. And A lot of what I listen to, I'd probably say I listen to a lot of Modest Mouse. It's probably my biggest influence, along with Bob Dylan. Um, but I listen to the Flaming Lips, are a big, big band for me. Um, uh, shit, I don't even know. Murder by yeah. Death, Two Galants. Uh, really, just whatever, whatever's going on in the moment. As far as uh, the latest recording process, we're going to be playing some live shows over at Hangart and they'll all be recorded and they'll kind of set the structure for our next, uh, for our next album. We'll kind of go over, fill whatever needs to be cleaned up and do all the mixing off of that. Just kind of set that as a base for the next thing we come up with. And I, the way I see us recording, uh, it probably won't be too much of... The, some of the songs will probably be just the two of us, but I, I prefer to have the yeah. other instruments involved because... Yeah, I'm sure we'll have a lot of a lot of help. From yeah, friends. absolutely. Cellos, uh, trumpets, uh, shit, anything, bass, organs, synthesizers.
So we do have uh, quite a bit of people that enjoy the line uh, and a bag of Coke. Um, and it's kind of funny about that. I think when I first wrote that, I hadn't even tried Coke yet. Maybe. I think, I don't, well, I think when we first wrote that, the line was in a pack of smokes. Yeah. When there's old people around and we play that, we usually change it Sometimes that a we bit. change it back to in a pack of smokes. That's hard to say, actually. I don't, even, I don't know. I mean, let's just say I like to party and have a good time. And uh, I think other and people like to party and have think, a good time, too. I think it's pretty obvious our audience definitely likes to party and have a good time. So I think uh, I think people can uh, dig on that, maybe. Yeah. 